Hi, I'm Drex, and this is Introduction to Poise Spinning from Spinballs. In this video, we're going to cover your first horizontal plane move, the corkscrew. Corkscrews are actually more or less the same thing as a two-beat weave, but performed in a horizontal plane. If you watched either one from the right angle, you'd be hard-pressed to tell the difference. So how do we learn the corkscrew? We're going to start with each hand individually and then put them together. Put your hands at your sides and raise your right hand as though swatting a mosquito near your left ear, and let your hand pass behind your head before sweeping past your right ear, and finally returning it to your side. Now take one of your poi and shorten it up, holding the handle with your right hand and the head in your left. Perform the same motion and let the poi become a tow rope, pulling your left hand through the exact same motion as your right, but a foot or so behind. You should find that you settle into an easy 1-2-1-2 one, two, one, two rhythm, with the right hand leaving and arriving on the 1, and your left hand leaving and arriving on the 2. Make sure that your right hand is pulling your left hand through though. Do not let your hands stay together through this motion, or you're going to have timing problems when you add the other poi into the picture. Now let's try it with both hands at the same time, each of them holding a poi. Start off slow, thinking to yourself, up, up, down, down, and stopping for however long it takes to get your bearings again. Up, up, down, down, and you're back to where you started. As this gets to feel comfortable, try moving your hands much more rapidly through the pattern and keep it continuous, allowing the poi to pull outward from the handle rather than dragging beneath it. You may find you have to lean over on the bottom side of this trick depending upon how long your poi are compared to your arms. It's totally fine to do so, but you can also get around this by wrapping the poi around your hands to shorten them up a little bit. The most common problem people have in learning this move is that their poi wind up in together time rather than split time. This is usually caused by not having enough space between the right hand and the left hand as they perform this move. One way to solve this problem is to take the same exercise we did earlier, holding the poi with both hands, but to actively resist having the left hand moved. This will work to delay the left hand as much as possible, giving it more of a split time feel as it goes around both the top and the bottom. Corkscrews make for a great dynamic contrast with many of the wheel and wall plane moves that we've learned in other videos. They look much more three-dimensional to your audience and can create visually dazzling spiral patterns in midair. Thanks so much for watching. Now show us what you can do. Share your photos and videos of your progress with Spinballs.